Hi everyone, thank you for tuning into the ITIP Report. My name is Ava Ani. I hope all is well with you. Don't say nothing. It's been a minute. I know. Don't say nothing. Just like the video, comment, subscribe. Let me know your good thoughts. And yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys, I want to let you guys know my favorite group of all time is going on tour. It is No Worries. If you don't know who No Worries is, it's Anderson Pack, phenomenal artist, and one of my favorite producers, Knowledge. Together, they combine into an epic duo that they are just really having me on edge because I've been waiting for this album to drop probably about four years. It has not dropped yet. They put out really good music. Um, they start teasing me and stuff with uh, doing a live single on YouTube. I'm like, ooh, this sounds so good. I can't wait to hear the album. And then they get quiet. And then I'm still waiting for a vinyl release audio release something some more videos something and then they kill it because then they drop a video and it's like throwback vibes with one of my favorite other artists her shout outs to her and they kill it and i just love the video and then it gets silent no release no nothing and i'm like what's going on i keep doing um commentary when i get the chance it's been a minute on youtube don't judge me and nothing and then all of a sudden they got a tour no worries has a tour coming out so they have all the i have to do i have to post a flyer on um my youtube shorts but then i'm like oh yeah i gotta i want to go to this i gotta go to and then i realize i have plans so I'm like, I'm disappointed, but I was like, you know what? That's going to be on my list. I got to go to a No Worries show, but I can't go to this one. I think they're going to be in New York this year. Yes, I am a Myra. I'm not a fan. I love them dearly because they put out dope music. There's no one that sounds like No Worries. That's why I... Don't have no worries because I know when they drop this project, it's going to be epic. <laughs> anyway, guys, they're on tour. Go and support them. I want to support them, but I, I, I'm not available because I got, I'm busy now and I got these plans and stuff. But I want you to go and support them and say, I'll buy you sent you. Just do that for me. I will be very happy. Like, yo, Ava Ani sent me to your show. Anyway, shout out to No Worries. I admire them dearly. Their music is phenomenal. I still love their classic stuff. And I'm waiting for new stuff, you know? When you think about artists, you're like, Dad, could these people just, the people that you love the most, can they drop an album, like, at least every year or something? You know? I'm going to tell you somebody I, I would like to get many a albums i think we've been cheated on q-tip shout out to q-tip people don't give him props for his production style and his producing he's just all around talented like i need to get like seven to ten q-tip albums i'm i'm waiting like come on y'all what's going on good music anyway Nevertheless, let's talk about yesterday. Yesterday, Wednesday, NYC. I had an appointment to go to, and I'm going to tell you guys, I am 46 going on, 47. Shout out to the Libras. Shout out to the Virgos and the Leos. Yo, I went outside yesterday. It was doom and gloom. Like, I've seen doom and gloom weather. But this right here, yesterday, caught me off guard. Guys, is this a sign? I feel like it's a sign of something. And it ain't looking good. Because what I seen yesterday with the air quality and just... 
how outside look, the weather, and I smell smoke. Yo. Survival of the fittest. Good grief. Rest in peace, the prodigy. Shout outs to Havoc. They were way ahead of their time. Because, yo, survival. I'm. We, <laughs> did you guys see yesterday outside? If you lived in New York or whatever locations where the weather was going to be bad, did y'all see that? That wasn't normal. I'm 46 years old and I have never seen weather smelling it and looking at it like, like yesterday. And I, I heard it was going to be like this today. Oh my. OMG. That's all I can say. I'm going to tell you, if you're watching this video, I want you to take this in mind. Start thinking survival mode. Right now, it's okay. It's not the great, like, you know, the world is not the most beautiful place to live in and dealing with mean people and stuff like that. But really take into consideration that if you wake up one day and it's just a mess, think about how you're going to survive. Start getting your mind mentally ready if it comes down to that. I, I pray and hope it does not come down to that. But it's looking real scary out here. Mm hmm It's looking real scary. Good grief. If you don't got to go outside tomorrow, don't. Today, I'm saying tomorrow. Today, don't. Stay in the house. You got asthma. If you got any breathing issues, the list goes on. Be safe. I, w I hadn't, I was going to go to an event tomorrow and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to that. Thrill out here. Stock up on food. Stock up on supplies. If no one listen, you watch if you watch videos day in day out. If no one tell you, listen to what I'm telling you. Stock up on water, food, survival tactics, protection. Be creative. Because it's just different. I'm telling you, it's just a different type of situation now that we are living in. It's alarming. 